ever worry about missing the moment? Not really. I think the whole process is, uh, you know, if you rush it and try and think you're missing things and get worried about that, you, you miss things more. You, it, it's all about being even paced and just letting things come towards you. What could be more entertaining than watching friends, family and work colleagues squirm, beg and spontaneously combust as you boost their brains with the power of your mind games? The new season's about to kick off. It's time to twist some melons. Twisting my melon, man. I remember exactly what we said. Oh. Did we? That sounds outrageously forward of me. Did I really suggest that? When? <laughs> yeah, I'm still here. Maybe. Okay. Room number. Roughly 200 years ago, Britain was the biggest exporter of wool and woolen cloth across the world. And my vision is that we're working with Fox Brothers and the whole sheep industry, that we can once again be a big exporter of cloth right across the globe. The only man in the world, in the world, eight billion people, whatever it is, to have won the Grand Slam on the regular tour and the Grand Slam on the senior tour. And they all tried. It was really hard to pick one BBC moment, so I've gone for one BBC legend, a man that I was completely obsessed with as a kid and still still in you know watch him most nights actually his name is david attenborough and he has just been a true inspiring broadcaster for me you go to any cricket test match and you see everyone holding a transistor radio to their ear and it would be test match special and it was where me and my dad bonded more than any 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 other place or in any other way and it was through those guys talking just going talking about chocolate cake about a bus going past, about the test match cricket. It was all very slow paced, but it was so significant to all of us. Share your hashtag BBC moments. Yeah, there's something that's quite identifiable when you drive a BMW, you know you're in a really good car. It's just a smooth ride. And uh, even driving over the fields behind me, it was really good and actually, I think in some cars I'd be quite nervous about driving across fields. I'd be worried that I was gonna get be stuck especially as it starts to rain a little bit all in all really impressive car and what I like most is the fact that there's this little hideaway where you can put muddy shoes so you don't have to get mud everywhere in the car as well a really really good practical family car and quite a handsome one too Well, we have quite an assortment of animals here. A couple of noisy dogs, Flurry and Slipper. We have chickens, we have bantams, we have horses and sheep. Well, we used to have some cows um, and we had a bull actually as well called Didums, but um, we found that they escaped rather more often than we would like. So um, with much regret, we got rid of the cows and sheep are much easier, I think. Um, there's something really historic about it and they've always stayed true to their DNA which is flattering, beautiful clothes that make women really feel like women. So when discussing with them to collaborate on this exclusive bag line, Le Marche, and to customise our own matches fashion version, um, we were really felt that it was the right partnership to do so. The features in the Active Tourer would certainly give a greater dimension to when we're travelling as like the panoramic roof. They would en enhance the games that we play in the car, like the I Spy games. It's only able to spot things through the certainly, roof instead yeah, of just... spotting things out the roof as we drive past them and then we've got no chance of, <laughs> of guessing what they are. <laughs> Yeah. 
Foot Patrol. Originally opened its doors in 2002 and uh, it was a focal point for sneaker scene within London. The partnership between Foot Patrol and Clarks came about with the first range of Clarks sportswear and shortly afterwards the guys from Clarks approached us to do a project with them. We probably all think we know what the Green Party stands for on the environment and perhaps energy policy, but what about science? I asked science and technology spokesperson Councillor James Abbott to set out the highlights of green policy on science. We're a very pro-science party. I think there's a lot of misnomers out there about the Green Party's position, and in particularly three areas. We think that science is important and science education is important for its own sake. Die neue Unity Remote, die Universalfernbedienung von Gear 4. Mit dem Unity Remote Gerät und der Applikation können Sie alle Ihre Unterhaltungselektronikgeräte von Ihrem iPhone aus steuern. Platzieren Sie die Unity Remote einfach ins Zimmer und steuern Sie dann mit der Applikation jedes Gerät, das Infrarot verwendet. Damit benötigen Sie für alle Geräte nur eine einzige Fernbedienung, die in Ihre Tasche passt. Sie können Makros programmieren, um mehrere Geräte im Zimmer auf Tastendruck ein- und auszuschalten. Alles kann von Ihrem iPhone mit der Unity Remote gesteuert werden. For us, it's always been about the steps that move you to your destination. From early morning wake-ups to mid-morning coffee cups. From sorting through email to checking every last detail. Even the longest journey is made up of single steps. And at Todoist, we believe in every one. We believe in what you're doing. And not just what you're doing. We believe in how you do it and why you do it. I'm a PE teacher, machine operator. I'm a prison officer. I'm a support worker for kids with behaviour problems. Supper clubs are this phenomenon that really got going in London four or five years ago maybe. Um, having been imported somewhat from New York and originally from Cuba where they were started in people's homes. And I think the thing that appeals to so many people about supper clubs is that instead of the restaurant experience which is very isolated and you sit on your own table, at a supper club you sit with complete strangers. Arsenal fans deserve a smartphone that reflects the quality of our team. This is why Huawei have created the Ascent P7 Arsenal Edition.